Hey everybody, it's Dominic. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make this blow gun, this dart gun out of bamboo. Uh, it shoots these, which is duct tape, a nail, and paper on the inside. And this is obviously bamboo. I'll give you a demonstration here. That's a cardboard carrying tray from the supermarket. As you can see, it shoots pretty hard and pretty straight, and it's fun to make and fun to play with and to show your friends. So here we go, I'll teach you how to make it, so stay tuned. Alright, so what you're going to need for this project is your bamboo rod that's not hollowed out, your metal rod that you're going to use for for uh, pushing through the bamboo rod and your blowtorch so you can get the red metal rod hot and you can use a gas mask if you would like for the smoke but it doesn't make that much smoke and so it's not that bad so let's begin so the first thing you're going to do is take your metal rod and stick it in a vise, like so. Now you're gonna take your bamboo to your bamboo rod, this one, and your blowtorch, and let's readjust the camera. And what you're gonna do is take your blowtorch, and you're gonna spray the end of the metal rod until it gets red hot. And let, let me show you. We might speed this part up. Once you've got your metal rod good and hot, well, that's not good for it. You're gonna take your bamboo rod and push it up against the metal and what that'll do is hollow out these chambers like that so after that you take your gas and just heat it up again it won't take that long this time because it was already heated before You want to make it as smooth on the inside as you can. See? Now we're in one, two, three, four, five chambers in. So now we heat it up again. See, we're almost through. And after a while, you can turn around the bamboo stick and go in the other. We're all the way through. So once you're all the way through, 
just blow out all the all the stuff that's inside and just keep repeating the process until you get the entire inside of it really smooth because right now if you look inside you probably can't tell from the camera but it's not yeah you can't tell it's not smooth at all in there and so you just keep repeating this process until you get the whole inside of the blowgun really well, really, really well cut out so that it looks, so that the dart will flow through it well. The objects you see in front of you are the objects to make the dart for the gun. So you need your paper, your knife, dart gun to shoot it out of, your nail, which uh, size isn't really that important as long as it's about that big. Big enough to be able to shoot into stuff, but not so big you can't breathe hard enough to get it going out of the gun. And your duct tape. So the way you do this is you take your paper, and this is the hardest step, you roll it until you get a tip about the width of the nail. And this this can be really tricky. It doesn't seem like it would be, but it is. Because the paper never ever wants to cooperate with you. So then you take your tape, take a piece, and tape the upper area just so it'll stay a little better and then in the end here drop in your nail so it sticks out like that now you take another piece of tape once you know that you got the size right. And wrap up the end here. And then put your nail back through. You didn't have to take your nail out, but sometimes it comes out. So there you go. You got it taped, so now you can actually work with it. So just take the duct tape and fix up the dart so that it'll stick and that it won't fall apart. So make sure you got the nail and the paper, you got a strip that attaches to both so that it doesn't come apart. And then make sure you've got it taped. You don't need to tape to the top, but you want to tape pretty good ways up so that you can actually do the next step. So that should be good. If you can see that. All right. Now just do a few little finishing little strips like this, little small strips and connect the nail to the rest of the tape like that. All right. Now what you do is you take this dart and put it in the smaller end of your blowgun, which for me is this end. Now take your knife or your scissors, whichever you prefer. Oops. And you slice away at it. I'm going to use my knife. Put it in up to where it'll fit. And then slice. There. And now you can see we have a dart that will fit in the barrel. And after that, you may have to do just a little bit of trimming. 
just to make sure it doesn't get stuck because after th this much work it really sucks when one gets stuck. Alright, so that looks about good. Now let's go test it. Now we are back out to our box. It's a little bit later after we made it with our new dart, the flaming dart. And let's let's try this out and see how good it works. Look at that. Stuck right in the box. So there you have it. How to make your homemade bamboo dart gun that shoots duct tape darts. It works really good. I hope you have fun with it. See you next time.